<laughs> what can we do as parents? Particularly if we have limited space at home, what I often recommend is setting up what I call the magic box, full of a selection of creative items that the children can explore and create with. Obviously, depending on the age, you'd adapt the materials. Um, but I would usually recommend some two-dimensional, some three-dimensional, and maybe a few items for uh, creative, dramatic play. From the point of view of paper, often we give children A4. Recycling, I know, is great, and you often get print at the back, but from the point of view of creativity, a sheet of A4 is well within your peripheral vision. And so you're immediately having other things interrupted and it becomes limited. Once you have a sheet of A3, it is actually on the edge of a child's peripheral vision. And they begin to feel it's a big explorative space. This is their world where they can explore and draw. I also recommend large, colourful, rewarding crayons. These are some lovely crayons called twistables that you don't need to exert much pressure, but they're lovely and rich and deep. So particularly for the younger children, or if you're working with children with special needs, go for something large and colourful, immediate and rewarding. I also recommend things like pipe cleaners, sprinkles, things that are three-dimensional, that they can stick on, that they can build up layers and make creative. Play-Doh or clay, so they have something that allows them to mould and sculpt and be more physical create three-dimensional forms and you can make this very easily at home with flour and water and oil. Again, not expensive, watered down paint and something you use for your ironing or your plants. And children love the spontaneity and the patterns that are randomly created. Again, not very expensive. If you're using paints, particularly with younger children, make sure that they are non-toxic, safe paints. And from a creative drama point of view, if you don't have lots of costumes, a big sheet of coloured fabric is wonderful. It can be a cape for a princess or a superhero. It can be used for dance, hide and seek, any games like that. A couple of these can the children can have lots of fun with. And obviously, any other special interests that your children have, you can put things in the box, you can change it every month or so, so it continues to be the adventure. And most of all, have fun. Monkey see, monkey like, monkey do. Bananamana.com. <coughs>